from VOA Learning English, this is the Technology Report. Energy companies are increasingly using hydraulic fracturing and horizontal drilling methods in many parts of the United States. These processes are used to get to supplies of fossil fuels like gas and oil that were too hard to reach in the past. But they also raise concerns about water pollution. Recently, a committee in the California State Assembly approved bills that would suspend hydraulic fracturing, also called fracking. The process involves injecting high-pressure water, sand, and chemicals deep underground to release trapped oil and natural gas. The bills would ban fracking until more is known about possible effects on health and the environment. The full state assembly has yet to act on the measures. Traditionally, energy producing companies drilled wells straight down into the earth. With horizontal drilling, they can now go down and then change direction to follow layers of rock that trap energy. A company called Origin Oil developed a machine that removes sludge and other unwanted material from water that comes from an oil drilling site. Riggs Eckleberry works with the company. He says the machine is using a process that was first developed to remove algae from water. Protests against fracking have grown because of concern over water pollution. Andrew Barron is attempting to find a way to deal with those concerns. He is developing tracers. These are substances used during fracking that can help identify the starting point of water pollution. Andrew Barron thinks it will provide better information for everyone concerned about fracking. For VOA Learning English, I'm Carolyn Prasuti.